Welcome to the Crazy Town Podcast. I'm Jonas. And I'm TNT Don. I'm IT Explosive One. Let's crack into another one. So TNT. Yo. Um, you know, have you ever, did, when you were younger, or I don't know, maybe when you were older, have you ever been to a high school football game? Yeah, man. We used to go to, who, where was our high school football team, Jonas? The Panthers. We were the Panthers. Yeah, we sucked. We the, always lost. The Ashtab- now they're the Dragons. The Ashtabula Panthers, the man. Lakeside Dragons. We had good colors, too. Black and gold, baby. Yeah, those I've been to a couple in the harbor. Oh, yeah. The Mariners. Right. The Mariners. Oh, yeah. God, ew. Yeah. So, I've been to a couple Panthers games, yeah. So, uh. Oh, my God. I know what you're talking about. Wow, I didn't even say anything. I was going to bring the story up, too. This About is the, the band? Other, this is the other story, I think. Go ahead. Keep, About the band? I don't know. Oh, actually, maybe not. Go ahead. Oh, continue. what do you got, then? Let's no, go. No, keep it going. Keep it going. So, we in Alabama, do both. Why not both? There was a band director, mm-hmm. and, and they were at the football game, and they were and he was in the, they were trying to clear out the stadium, and he, and he had the band performing. Mm-hmm. And... They, I guess, like the cops came up to him and was like, Hey, you know, we're trying to clear out the stadium, like, whatever. And he was just like, Get out of here, like, get out of my face. Like, I'm just the band is performing or whatever. They ended up like tasing him and like arrest, like, because he wouldn't stop. I'm not, I'm not laughing because it's funny. He, what? he wouldn't stop the band. They said, like, I guess they tried to say he got, arre- he got aggressive and tried to like swing or something. Or, but like, they were just, they're trying to get him to stop having the band perform. And it escalated to the point where he got tased and handcuffed. And like, I was just like, what the what the hell like what why what? the band directors like out here just like trying to have the band play music what what why wait okay so what, what was his impetus for having a band play because he wanted to i guess like what's it hurt what's it hurt to have the band play if what? there's any people that could be left in the stadium it's the goddamn high school band who cares it seems to me that tasing a guy um is a little far in handcuffs yeah, yeah, they got like, him. He, he must have started an altercation. He probably did. What it I don't like know. To it was wild, though. I've never seen anybody tased at a football game, though. You ever seen I, anybody tased in general? I have never seen any. Well, except for that one video where the dude's like, don't tase me, bro. I mean, in person. No, not in You've person. never been out and like they just tased the guy? I've tased was- myself. I've seen my friends tase themselves. That's wild you ever just have like one of the tasers take like a nine volt and just tase yourself a little bit a nine volt taser yeah i don't little, think those exist they used to yeah they're like a little mini personal oh taser. not like a real taser no not like it shoots the prongs out into your skin and like electrocute you type shit but no, no i'm good now, do you know what john see I, the story i thought you were going to get okay into, yeah I'm, I'm intrigued now which is pretty wild too uh there's a shocking moment where a group of male Brazilian medical students perform a group masturbation on a woman's volleyball court after their college team beat their rivals. What? Okay, so this happened in Brazil. And uh, medical students, you know, these are future doctors, Brazilian doctors. Or nurses, yeah. Uh, sure. Um, volleyball, college volleyball team beats their rivals. They're celebrating. And prior to the game, you could see these guys on the sidelines with their pants around their ankles, but boxers on. Kind of odd. After they win the big game, they all jump around and circle up around the court. And they like. Like, how many guys are we talking? Okay, so apparently six of them. Oh, six. Okay. Six of the guys who actually were per- performing the act are, were all expelled. Um, but it looked like there were probably about 15. 15 to 20 who actually were like dancing and stuff. Just not everybody had their pieces out. But yes, yeah, six six guys were expelled because That's of it. really weird. I like to think that doctors are smart. You know, whether you speak English or not, you know, I'm pretty sure that, you know, learning the body, you got to have some sort of degree of understanding, the ability to learn. I would think that pulling my penis out and doing anything with it in front of people that aren't your sexual partners yeah probably one of those things you shouldn't do that's just me like yeah i have never one time in my entire life been like you know what i should do right now pull out my piece i, I can't say is that i I've, <laughs> I've never thought it was a good time to do that i mean not i mean just like Sometimes in public it's a great time in public i mean oh like, in public just like out like out at a football game like you know what i should do right now so whip it out 
When is a good time? Never in public for a person to pull. Hold on, there's got to be. An, I mean, I've peed in a peed in an alley or something before. That's probably illegal. that's not a good probably. Time. I don't. I can't think of a time, but I imagine at some point I peed in an alley somewhere. Yeah, I don't know. I was just trying to think of like hypothetically. Is there ever a time where it's where it's good for you to pull your junk out in public? Hmm. Oh God. Um, like what what could be happening? Like there's a mugger and he's like, I would say, yeah, if you don't pull out your penis right now, I'm going to shoot this lady. You. I'm going to murder you or you're this lady or whatever. Yeah, I guess I, uh, I'd be like, no, sir, that is against the law. <laughs> and he's like murdering against the law too, pop pop. <laughs> and it'd be rude to do with all these people here. Yeah, dude, I can't. I don't. Think yeah. They're... Yeah. I, I don't know, man. I don't know what these guys were thinking. It's really it's really a shame. Um. Especially when you think of all the people in the stands who had to see this. Dude. There's video of it, too. And, yes, I have seen the video for science. For I mean, science. I, I mean, we're not going to judge you for it. You like watching on the internet, man. It wasn't. Like, you really couldn't see it. They zoomed in, I heard. You, you told really, me about it. it. It's a Brazilian piece, so it doesn't, you know. So it was waxed. But um, it, it was whack. What, what did, so what were, like, the lady players doing? Running away? Uh, you know, they were like celebrating, hugging each other and like, you know, you know, typical volleyball, like it's court volleyball attire. So, yeah, you know. it's like that. I mean, it's like that boxer girl who like ripped her top off and pulled her boobies out. Like, I know. I mean, like, and she got, she got expelled from the league, right? They, she, I think they she, took her license for fighting. Yeah. Yeah. It's I wild. mean, honestly, it makes sense. I don't know how many times we have to tell you this old man, keep your sex parts in. And Keep when you're on your a job, sex parts in the, the the ironic part about that is that men fight with their shirts off. What does that mean? A woman takes her shirt off, she gets disbarred. Ooh. A men fight with their shirt off from the Ooh. start. Ooh, Jonah, you spitting facts. You saying we should let the girls go? Let them fight with that shirts on, bro. I don't know. I don't. Th I think that would be. I don't think any girl would go for that. And that's they fine if the they way. don't. But why should she get in trouble because she want to take her shirt off? You're not even wrong. You're I mean, wrong. it ain't. It ain't like. I mean, the same thing. Like Janet Jackson whips out her titty on TV, and it was like she fucking started the Holocaust. Well, you you can't be doing that, right? Can't wait. Your... So wait, Jonas, you're trying to say is that we should free the nipple? Is that what you're trying to say? Um, I Are mean, you I a god dang feminist? I wouldn't be a, a, I wouldn't be offended if somebody freed a nipple. Are you a feminist? I would say probably. Yeah. Okay. I'd say so. So you I'm think all about equality and shit? You just think that women should be allowed to do whatever they want now, huh? Sure. Why not? Vote. <laughs> Vote. <laughs> Excuse. I, was it, it's 2023, mm -hmm. not 1923. <laughs> you think they should work? Be able to work? Yeah, I don't know. Outside man. of the home. Work outside the home. Let's see. Like, or, really? I don't know. But no, man, I don't know. I, it's just, I cannot believe that dudes would jerk it on a court, like anywhere. It's just, I mean, I'm not going to lie. I have definitely pulled up to a traffic light in Austin, looked to my left, and saw a homeless man jacking off on the corner. Wow, you've I've, seen that? I've absolutely seen that. Okay. I, yeah. He was laying down on the ground, so I didn't know what he was doing at first. Like, I looked over, I was like, what's that guy? Oh my God, he's jerking off. Like, it, like, yeah, I was with a, I was with a lady friend, and we were like, "Oh, that mm. was nice little, nice little, nice little cap to the <laughs> little present for you for both of us." A you little know? piece of eye candy. Yeah, it was really weird. Yeah, I, I don't know either, man. I've I've never seen a homeless person do it. I've seen you know, in my occasion, I've seen it done before. I've seen it done before. I don't, it's like I don't want to talk about how I have, but it's you know, it's totally fine. It's not there like was, um, I wasn't in a room with them or anything. This one time, I went over to a friend's house in high school, and it uh -oh. was like we were having like a he was having a party. His dad was out of town uh -oh. or something. Uh oh, I know where this is going. And there was a and there was a kid there that no one else knew. He was from another school. Oh, okay. So. Where was it going before? I thought you it was, sound so de depressed. When I thought I you were going to come out of the closet. No, no. So we were all just like sitting there chilling, and homeboy goes to the bathroom or something, and uh -huh. like, and he comes back out, and he just has his balls through his zipper, and he's like, "Look, everybody, it's the brain." And we were like, "What the fuck is wrong with you, dude? Like, why are you just like?" He just nobody laughed. No, no. 
<laughs> no money. Not land. one of us was like. We were like, "What is wrong with you? Would you and your friends just hang out, and put their balls through their zipper, and just be like, it's the brain?" Like I was just like, "What the hell is wrong he with this?" Person? He was gonna be life for the party, man. He, he was did. the party guy. He was, he was depressed after that. Not I really. would he imagine was, so. He was just as weird. <laughs> Bro, I always put his balls in his pants after that. I always think it's weird when people think that that you know it's like it speaks volumes about like what is going on in your home life when six guys can get on a volleyball court and start jerking it. And like how think, is that so normalized to the six of you that you think that that's okay? Yeah, and like nobody said, "Hey guys, I don't think this is a good idea." Where was that? Yeah, like if I was ever out with six of my friends at the bar, I'm like, you know, what we should do let's jump on the bar and jerk off. I'd be like, "Hey guys." You do what you want, but I think that's a bad idea. And then I probably wouldn't hang out with them anymore once I, re <laughs> once I realized that they were, like, remotely serious. It's one thing for your friends to be like, oh, ha, ha, we're going to do something stupid. And you're like, bro, that's kind of dumb. And they're like, but to yeah. actually do something stupid. Like, you're actually like, yeah. do it? Right. Yeah, yeah. You're I can't, like, I can't really? Like, you're my, guys, I, like, I can't even be your friend. So, I don't know. Go to thegracedown.com for Jonas. TNT. Uh, we out.